Hi, big church power fans. This video comes to you from a freshly harvested cornfield located in central Illinois, where a 470 engine horsepower Ford 1156 articulated four wheel drive tractor is working on fall tillage with an 18 foot wide Kaysite Akolo Tiger 875 disc ripper. This big tillage machine is equipped with nine 24 inch spaced shanks running 12 inches deep breaking up compaction, turning under the corn stalks, and preparing the seedbed for next year's crop. The 1156 is the largest tractor ever offered by Ford. In this video, I would like to share with you this four-wheel drive tractor's production history, specifications, and original price tag. But first, let's head out to the field so that you can see and hear this big tillage team at work. The 1156 is the largest tractor ever offered by Ford. It became part of the Ford tractor lineup through the acquisition of the Versatile Tractor Corporation in 1987. Versatile began manufacturing articulated four-wheel drive tractors in 1966 and quickly became a leading manufacturer of high horsepower tractors in the 1970s. By the 1980s, the company had an advanced lineup of tractors all the way up to 470 engine horsepower. Unfortunately, by the mid-1980s, the company fell on hard times because of the farm equipment economy sinking into depression, with low grain prices, high interest rates, and drought impacting farmers not allowing them to invest in new high-horsepowered machinery. The Model 1156 was introduced by Versatile for model year 1986. It was a direct upgrade to the company's popular Model 1150 introduced in 1981. Unfortunately, because of the economic downturn in the farm equipment market, Versatile ceased all tractor production in July of 1986. Ford New Holland, looking to expand its range of tractors into the articulated market, acquired Versatile on March 25, 1987 for the price tag of $105 million and assuming the $115 million debt that Versatile had accrued. Ford Motors quickly resumed Versatile tractor production in Winnipeg, Manitoba following the acquisition. The company was merged into the Ford New Holland Agriculture Division and the four-wheel drive tractors were distributed across North America through Ford New Holland dealers. Initially, there were not any major changes made to the versatile tractor's appearance. They retained their traditional red, yellow, and black paint scheme. The only cosmetic change was the addition of a Ford blue oval to the tractor's hood and a slight change from the versatile tannish yellow to New Holland yellow on the tractor's roof, wheels, and grill. A few years after the Ford New Holland Versatile merger, Ford executives attending the Sunbelt Ag Expo in Moultrie, Georgia, took a look at their competition's exhibits. John Deere, Case International, Dwight's Alice, and White New Idea all had common branding and paint schemes across their entire equipment lineup. 
The Ford executives decided that for model year 1990, that the versatile tractor range would take on the traditional Ford blue and white paint scheme, as well as Ford branding to match the rest of the tractor lineup that the company offered. The big blue Ford 1156 was introduced in February 1990 at the company's annual dealer meeting held in Las Vegas, Nevada. This big tractor replaced the versatile 1156 manufactured from 1986 through 1989. The Ford 1156 is powered by an 18.8 liter Cummins KTA 1150C turbocharged after cooled 1,150 cubic inch six cylinder engine rated at 470 engine horsepower. This tractor is fitted with a 400 gallon diesel fuel tank and features a gear drive transmission offering eight forward and four reverse speeds. It weighed in from the factory at 28,844 pounds and could be field weighted up to 46,000 500 pounds. The original price tag for the Ford 1156 when it was new was $170,107. The Ford 1156 had a short production life. Unfortunately, the farm equipment economy had not completely recovered by the early 1990s and farmers were not lining up to pay nearly $200,000 for a new high horsepower tractor. Ford ultimately decided to retire the 1156 from production after model year 1991. The 360 engine horsepower model Ford 976 designation 6 tractor became the new top end machine from the company. The 976 remained in production through model year 1993 when it was replaced by the new 400 engine horsepower model 9880 for model year 1994. I hope you've enjoyed spending some time out in the field with this Ford 1156 articulated four-wheel drive tractor working on fall tillage. I'd like to hear in the comment section below this video if you use Ford, Versatile, or New Holland articulated four-wheel drive tractors on your farm. Tell me about the model that you're running and the implements that it operates. If you've enjoyed this video, consider subscribing to Big Tractor Power YouTube, where there's over 2,000 videos of farm machines in action. If you would like to see additional content from the channel featuring big articulated tractors at work, continue to watch for a few more seconds to the end screen for a direct link to more Big Tractor Power YouTube videos. As always, thank you for watching.